One Punch! So, this is my review slash reaction to One Punch Man Episode 2. Couple things to know. I feel as though this episode definitely cemented exactly what type of show One Punch Man is going to be. I mean, Episode 1 kind of showcased that, but I felt as though Episode 2 really cemented that. For the most part, it is a lot of comedy-based stuff, where it's kind of like Saitama with jokes and little shit like him trying to kill the mosquito in this episode. But there's also really epicness to it, and I'm hoping from what I've heard as well, there will be some more serious bits, but definitely it seems more like it's mostly focused on comedy and epicness, which isn't necessarily a bad thing, because the epicness in this episode, especially, like, the art and animation, I can't stress enough, again, Madhouse knows what the fuck they're doing, and if that is your kind of show, as far as, like, you want some really awesome action, some really awesome art and animation, and some really epic comedy... Episode 2 yet again delivers it and showcases that that's what One Punch Man is going to be top of the line and is like comedy and action, you're going to get that from One Punch Man and then some because this episode is bad fucking ass, so getting introduced to Genos in this episode, like, I was kind of conflicted as to how to feel with him after this episode because granted he was pretty fucking epic and his character design is way sicker than like Saitama's, but I can't help but feel like Saitama overall is just still more epic because it's like Genos is kind of like struggling with shit and doing his thing like you can tell he's strong or whatever but like when he was fighting the mosquito bitch it was like he was struggling or whatever Saitama one punch and fucking ends it so as far as like the epicness of Genos is like he looks cool as shit but I still gotta fuck with my boy Saitama more Saitama is still more fucking epic and still more cooler simply because it's like one punch and you're fucking done and he doesn't really give a shit and I mean the comedy of this episode is something that definitely had me a little bit like cause I ain't gonna even lie when Genos kept on talking and talking and talking about his past, I was like, at first, oh, this is kind of interesting, but I genuinely felt like Saitama when he kept talking and talking and talking. I was like, shut the fuck up, Genos, you badass as shit, you look cool as fuck, but please be quiet. Also, I thought the characters in this show were going to be a lot older, like, Saitama, I know, I think he's like 24 or 25, I've said in this episode, but Genos is only 19, which is kind of interesting. I thought everybody was going to be like in their mid-20s to 30s, so... I guess Genos is kind of like for younger people to kind of relate to a little bit more. And I mean, with this episode, honestly, it just really kicked so much fucking ass. The art and animation and the action, like definitely something that was a staple. And personally, One Punch Man is one of those shows where I know I'll enjoy the fuck out of it. But it won't be like necessarily like one of my all-time favorites simply because like the plot is very, very simplistic. Like you see there's some baddies and there's some problems that Saitama has to go through. Not only just big, you know, monstrous problems, but like very simple ones like killing a mosquito and shit like that so it's kind of like a very chill show with epicness to it and comedy so it's like one of those like I can't really personally not saying this in a critical aspect but personally it's something where like I can just enjoy it for what it is but it doesn't really grab me like a parasite or a Tokyo Ghoul because it's not that kind of show so if you're looking for that show One Punch Man ain't it but episode 2 honestly yet again just kicks so much fucking ass like easily 7.5 to an 8 for this episode more so an 8 for this episode very good stuff very good awesome art and animation and action I can't stress that enough just the story is just kind of like not really too much so far I mean Genesis backstory was kind of cool and we see that he has a mission he's kind of like a wandering superhero but that's the extent of Genos. So overall, pretty kick-ass episode, honestly. It's just like, I'm hoping for more. I'm hoping for it to get just a little bit more serious. Like, don't take away the comedy because the comedy is pretty fucking hilarious. I ain't gonna lie to you. But just add a little bit more serious and get a little bit more to a certain degree. Because again, I know what show, what type of show One Punch Man is. A little bit more serious and we're golden. But let me know what you guys think. First of all, I guess I gotta ask, Saitama or Genos? Who do you think is more epic? I gotta go with Saitama. Like, even though Genos looks cooler, Saitama's just fucking awesome. Hey, overall, thoughts awesome episode two of One Punch Man. I definitely think I want to review this one through to the end since it's only 12, 13 episodes and I'm pretty fucking enjoying it. So why the fuck not, right? But that's all I have for this one. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you liked anything I had to say or enjoyed the video, drop me a punch. I'd greatly appreciate it. And if you haven't subscribed, if you can do so as well, that'd be amazing. I'm from the world and as always, people, have an awesome day or I might punch ya.